Hey, yo, what up, it's time. Same with me here. We are the Soul Brothers, and you know this, we're gonna hop in on a little first impressions video. Yep. The Curry Too Low by Under Armour. Yep. Sammy cop these, you put them on your feet, what do you think? Uh, okay, so not only did I put them on my feet, but I already played in them mm. once. <laughs> so it's not a first impression, mm. so I'm sorry. But, um, it's a second impression. It's the second impressions. okay. So um, it, everything about the shoe is the same as the regular ones besides the upper and that it's a low. So um, And it's full length speed form. Yeah, so um, let me just kind of briefly go over it. Mm -hmm. uh, the traction was all right. Uh, we'll get into that. I'll get into that in the actual review. I, I need to break these in a little bit, you know? And then um, the cushion is exactly the same. And then the, the insole seems to be exactly the same as the crease. Yeah, it's stitched you know? in. Yep. So um, yeah, so the differences, I'll just name the differences, I guess, uh, is the speed form, right? It's super soft. It feels basically like a textile, which is nice. But I really did not enjoy playing these when I did. Um, hopefully, when I keep playing these, I will start to enjoy it because Curry 2s are my favorite shoe right now to play in. But uh, these lows, just this material is just super soft. And um, there was really no support in the forefoot area, you know? So I, I kept feeling my foot like kind of uh, pop out, like right here when I'm doing hard cuts and crossovers mm -hmm. and stuff like that. Um, but hopefully, um, something happens and uh, I enjoy it, start enjoying it, you know? Yeah, uh, I, I don't think it looks nearly as good as the high. It looks like a freaking golf shoe. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah, so, <laughs> fucking tennis shoe. Yeah, yeah. dude. So, um, These are the new Pete Sampras joints <laughs> for you guys. Yeah, um, and then also the tongue is a lot thicker. It feels a lot nicer than the regular Curry Tooth. Yeah. Um, so yeah, that's about all of the differences. Oh, and also the heel lockdown uh, wasn't the best also in these for me. Um, it, when I'm walking or running, my heel is locked down, right? But then um, sometimes uh, I can just slip these shoes off. Right. You know, in the Jordan 30s, the Jordan 29, you know, um, shoes with crazy good heel lockdown, you can't even budge it. You, know, you, can, you can kind of feel the lip is very, you know, it's not an aggressive lip around yep. your Achilles. The more aggressive the lip, you can just, you already know it's going to be some heavy lockdown. Yep. You know what I mean? Especially if they start adding Achilles pillows, the lockdown is even better. This has no Achilles pillows and the, the lip is very, very shallow. I would say, you know, kind of flat-ish. Yeah. And then um, also this um, heel counter, TPU heel counter is really low. Yeah, you know, compared to low. other shoes that they usually go like a little like an inch or two higher so um the only thing that's containing your heel is this little thing right here and it's really low it doesn't go as high as it should mm -hmm. so um that was kind of a problem uh not too big of a deal because when i'm playing but um yeah right so that's kind of my first impressions uh the materials feel really nice it's just too soft a little bit so yeah all right, so there it is. Your boy Sammy the Big Boy will be back with the performance review ASAP. Um, so this is uh, Sammy's first impressions of the Under Armour Curry Low 2 Red. Yep. All right, my name is Don. Sammy here. We'll see you guys later. Peace.